530, a deadly accident in Brookline. A child killed after falling out an apartment window. It is the fourth time that a local child has fallen from a window in the past two weeks. In the three other cases, the children survived. So what can you do to protect the children in your home? Well, WBC's Bill Shields is live tonight in Quincy. And Bill, you spoke with a father whose son survived one of these falls? We did very briefly, but you know, Liam and Lisa, you know, this happens every year when the weather gets nice. People open up the glass window and you get the screen. The screen's not secured. The kids push and they go out. The other day, Saturday, a kid went from a seventh floor window here and didn't get a scratch. But sadly, yesterday in Brookline, a little five year old died. Yesterday in Brookline, a five year old girl falls from a fourth floor window, hits the concrete, and dies. The child was reportedly playing in a unit on the fourth floor and fell out the window. And Saturday, here in Quincy, a five year old boy also pushes the screen out and falls from the seventh floor and lives. But here, the boy kind of rode the screen down and hit bushes. His father didn't want to go on camera today, Hi. but simply said it was miraculous that his son wasn't hurt. Uh, he's fine. We're happy that he's, he's home. That's, that's all I can say. It is a miracle. Thank you. Thank you so much. In both cases, parents were home, but the screens gave way. But there are preventative measures. Here at Lowe's, they have several styles of sturdy window guards that adjust and fit to most windows. And those window guards are anywhere from 20 bucks to 30 or 40. But it's a small price to pay, I think, for safety. Reporting live in Quincy, I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News. Bill, thank you.